guys, it's I here, we can welcome back to another video today. We're gonna be reacting to SML movie Brooklyn Guys Tries to Help. Oh my goodness. It, I'd like to say the title of the thumbnail, Jimmy Butler. If you guys didn't know, um Jimmy Butler is also doing coffee thing. We seen in um every SML episodes. So this time Brooklyn Guys are gonna try to help Jimmy Butler get back into playing in the NBA again. Will he go back to his old roots? We'll have to find out and see. If you guys are new to the channel, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Like this video, leave a comment down in the comments down below. Without further ado, let's get on to the reaction. Hey, Pointy! Oh, why the long face? I'm watching the Miami Heat try to play basketball. But, Pointy, didn't they make the playoffs? No, Karen, they're not in the playoffs. They're just visiting the playoffs. What do you mean, Pointy? Well, it's kind of like when you adopt a sick kitten that you know is going to be dead in a week. I mean, sure, you can play with it, but every time you do, you're just going to be reminded of how it'll be dead soon. That's how it is with the Miami Heat. They're in the playoffs, but they're going to lose. Oh, oh, so they're like the Dallas Cowboys. Yes, exactly. They're not supposed to be there. I mean, they're in the playoffs, but it's really just for show. Okay, Pointy, but didn't they beat the Boston Celtics last year? Yes, they did. In seven games with Jimmy Butler, who is not playing. Wait, why isn't he playing, Boyne? Isn't that his job? Yeah, you would think so, but at least he has a good excuse this time. See, he hurt his knee losing a play-in game, and then his team went on to win without him, which gave me hope, but now they're just spreading their cheeks for the Celtics. Well, how long is it going to take for his knee to get better? Oh, with his diet of only ever drinking coffee, I'd say that he's going to lose long before he ever picks up another basketball. Wait, Boyne, I Aren't you a doctor? Can't you fix his knee? Yeah, you're right, Karen. I could probably go to the hospital and give him a pep talk or maybe some steroids. I'm gonna go see him. Oh, come on, boys. You're playing like you didn't drink your coffee. Speaking of coffee, nurse! Yes, Mr. Butler? I don't think my IV's working. I'm sure it isn't. We really should add water to it and not just coffee. Nope, I just want more big face coffee. Ugh, I'll start brewing a pot. Hey, Mr. Butler. Oh, hey, doctor. How's my leg doing? I don't know. I just got here. Oh, I see you're watching your team lose by 30. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, fuck it, right? Yeah, that's fine, it's only 30. I mean, it's not like it's 40, right, Jimmy? That would just be embarrassing. Well, there's always next season. Oh, okay, so you've just fully given up on this season. That's good to know. You know they can't win without you. Nurse! Yes, doctor? How, how bad is his knee? Well, he suffered a severe MCL sprain, so he could be out for weeks. Well, that's okay. That just gives me more time to make my coffee. Fucking snap out of it, Jimmy. What the fuck is going on in your head? I know that Jimmy that loves basketball is still in there somewhere. Okay, sir, 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 this brings up a bigger issue. I think he might be addicted to coffee. Yeah, you fucking think? Yeah? Yeah, Jimmy, I think so. Well, sir, if we fix the issue now, he could recover for next season. Wow, you really think so? You think maybe if we cure his coffee addiction, we could get knocked out of the playoffs in the second round next time? Boy, wouldn't that be a dream come true. The second round. Come on, Jimmy. Let's get you to Addictions Anonymous. All right, Jimmy. This is Addictions Anonymous. Everybody here is addicted to something. We're going to get you some help. Ooh, is that complimentary coffee? <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> Hello everyone, welcome to Addictions Anonymous. Now here we don't discriminate whether you're addicted to alcohol or drugs or sex. Bingo! Hey. Oh, well why don't you start us off? I would love to! Hello everybody, my name is Ronald McDonald. You probably heard of me. I caught you here! I have a store on every corner! Hi Ronald. Hey. So, I got a lot of problems, but my worst problem, it starts with an M and it ends with an S, and I'm sure you all probably know what it is, multiple hookers. I'm saying I spend tens of thousands of dollars a week on hookers. L let me give you an example of how bad it is. Let's say you're here, sitting right here in this meeting right now, right here. And I come up to you, and I say, Hey, you want to make $10,000 in about 25 seconds? And you say, yeah. Well, what I would do, I would pull out this stack of $10,000 cash, and then I would pull out a little letter saying it's a gift so you don't have to pay taxes. And I would probably take you to that room right over there and bend you the hell over. But... You, you know, you, you know, you know, you're not interested in that, so I'll just, I'll just slowly put it back in my pocket. Uh, hold on there, Ronald. Um, um, Mr. Cheetah, why don't you go next? Come on, Ronald. Okay. Oh, hell yeah. Chester, 
Chester, she called you. Uh, what? It's your turn. Oh, hey everybody, my name's Chester Cheetah. Hi, Chester Cheetah. And I have a terrible addiction to Cheetos. I like to crunch them up and snort them. My kids won't talk to me. My wife left me. All I have left is Cheetos. See, see Jimmy, you want to end up like that coked up Cheetah? That's what's going to happen if you don't give up coffee. Oh my God. <laughs> Man, I didn't know that some people here were addicted to choking. Um, um, ma'am, how about you go next? Oh my God, I'm like addicted to shopping and I would do anything to have more money to buy more stuff. Hey. Um, Mr. Jimmy Butler, sir, how about you go next? Oh, what? My turn? Well, I'm not really addicted to anything, so I don't really know why I'm here. Okay, Jimmy, thank you. I'll take it from here. Hey, everybody, this is NBA basketball player... Oh, I'm sorry. I misspoke. NBA country music singer and coffee barista Jimmy Butler. See, Jimmy here gets paid $200 million to play basketball, but instead of doing that, he would rather make coffee or do literally anything else other than play basketball. You name it, he'll probably do it, as long as it's not basketball. See, Jimmy lost the finals last year, and this year he can't even play because he's got a broken fucking knee or something. Somebody fell on it? I don't know. I'm assuming it's coffee related. But what I really want to say is I don't even care if the Heat lose every game for the rest of my life. As long as Jimmy does the one thing he gets paid to do, which is play fucking basketball. So please, I don't know how you people could possibly help him, but please, please help him. Help me help him because I have not seen one one fucking big face brick and mortar store, and I have never seen it on a grocery store sell shelf, so I don't know who the fuck you're selling this coffee to, Jimmy. You flew all the way down to Columbia to make a video about how your coffee gets made. He prides himself on it coming out of the ground. Of course it fucking comes out of the ground, Jimmy. It's coffee. Where else would it come from? I I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I I'm getting mad. I, I just, somebody please help him. That is so sad. <laughs> it is sad. The worst part about my addiction is now I went to it this Time. Yeah, come on. Oh, Jimmy, I don't think they're going to be back for a while. It's just Chester, and I don't think he can help. We should go back to the hospital. Oh, can I bring my coffee? Oh, you're back. How'd it go? Can somebody help me open my coffee? Oh. All right, Jimmy, we're going to do a little psychological test here. This is called an ink blot test. Just take a look at this picture and tell me what you see. Well, that looks like somebody spilled coffee on that piece of paper. Oh, okay. All right, fine. We'll, we'll do another one. All right, how about this one? Well, that looks like another coffee stain. Okay, but do you see something in the coffee stain? Mm, maybe some creamer. Ugh, okay, okay. All right, well, how about this one? This one's got color. Okay, well, that it, that's a pumpkin spice coffee. <laughs> okay, okay, Jimmy, how about we try some... Jimmy, Jimmy, focus. Huh? Huh? Okay, how about we try something else? Repeat after me, okay? Basketball. Coffee. Okay, hold on. Basketball. Coffee. Jimmy, are you listening? Uh, basketball. Basketball. Coffee. Okay, we're going to slow way down here, buddy. Bat. Basketball. Coffee. Oh, my God. God. Damn it, Jimmy. You were standing up earlier. I know you can still play basketball. We're going to have a montage and see if you can still make basketball shots. Put that down. Come on. Feels nice. Just enjoying a nice hot coffee bath. Oh, Jimmy, this has to stop. You want to know what my number's 22? Because there's two F's and two E's in coffee. <laughs>
<laughs> well, sir, how did the montage go? He can't do it. He can't fucking do it. Everything is just coffee. Well, have you thought about giving him the coffee and once he has it, see how he does? You don't understand. All he does is drink coffee. Last year, he drank coffee in the finals and he still lost. He's currently taking a coffee bath. What? A coffee bath. He is bathing in coffee. You know how some athletes take ice baths? He's taking a coffee bath. Well, is it at least iced coffee? No, it is fresh piping hot coffee. Dear God, we've lost him! Okay, that's it. I'm not just going to sit back and watch the Miami Heat get a train ran on him. I'm going to put on a jersey and go out there and play. But sir, sir, sir! You're what? I know, but so is Tyler Hero. Now where is my burned up Jimmy Butler jersey? Okay, okay, all I have to do is make this free throw, and we only lose by 25. Okay. Well, at least I'm actually trying and not just drinking coffee. Wow, it's really pretty out here. This reminds me of Columbia. You know, that's where I grow my coffee. I know, Jimmy. I know. Just think about the coffee, Jimmy. There's just so many different kinds of coffees. There's lattes and cappuccinos and cold brews and espressos. You know, my coffee contains smile matter. May cause happiness. I know, Jimmy. How do you take your coffee? Cream and two sugars, Jimmy. Cream and two sugars. <laughs> He's in a better place now. <laughs> oh, Boydy, what's wrong? Jimmy Butler can't hurt us anymore. He's in a better place now. What? He's in a place where he can have all the coffee he wants and nobody can bother him about basketball. Well, that sounds like a nice place, Boydy. Yeah, I just hope he's up there looking down on us right now. Fuck it, he's probably drinking coffee. God, I hate this sport! <laughs> Well, there you have it guys that is that's the movie broken guy tries to help it was a pretty good it was a good pretty good video like i said my favorite athlete is john cena the greatest of all time but i really like this this video i didn't like how the ending did but but what what can we say also guys, if you guys stay tuned to her and I greatly appreciate it, be sure to subscribe to the channel, like this video, leave a comment down in the comments down below, the original movie link in the description, my personal description as well. With that being said, I'll see you on the next video. And don't worry guys, I'm going to react to um, SML movie, um, kindergarten, um, tomorrow morning or in the afternoon, so stay tuned for that. Bye everyone.